in the name of Jesus, your Heron and your all, your divine destiny helpers, your two helpers, they will locate you in the remaining days of this month in the name of Jesus. Say, Father, I am repositioned to locate my destiny helpers. I am repositioned for my destiny helpers to locate me. Hello, child of God. Thank you for joining us one more time on the altar of victory today. In the past two days now, we have been praying the words of prophecy released by our Father and the Lord, Pastor E.A. E. Adeboye, during the special Holy Ghost service for this month. And today, by the grace of God, we'll continue in the prayers. As we pray today in the name of Jesus, I agree with you that before the end of this month, every word of prophecy that had been spoken by the mouth of our Father and the Lord for this month will not fall to the ground in your life. It will come to pass. In the remaining days to go this month, you will move from prophecies to prosperity, to testimonies, miracles, signs, and wonders. In the name of Jesus, amen. The first word of prophecy for today, as we pray, it says, as long as there is water in the ocean, your anointing will not run dry. Say amen. As long as there is water in the ocean, your anointing will not run dry. For the Bible says in Psalm chapter 92, verse 10, the Bible says, But my horn shall thou exalt, like the horn of an unicorn, I shall be anointed with fresh oil. In the name that is above every other name, the anointing of God upon your life will not run dry. The anointing of God that gives you divine ability to do what you do, to operate in the ministry you've been called, to operate with the gift and the talent God has given to you, that anointing will not run dry. Whatever the opposition and the challenges you face, the anointing of God upon your life will not run dry. You are anointed with fresh oil. God's anointing upon you is renewed, is refreshed in the name of Jesus. That anointing will speak upon your life, will break yokes around you in the name of Jesus. That anointing will work miracles, signs, and wonders upon your life. The Bible says how God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power. Who went about doing good and healing all that were oppressed of the devil? So God was with him. That anointing of God upon your life will make you a miracle, a sign and a wonder. Will make you a miracle worker yourself. That anointing will be made ever fresh in the name of Jesus. Whatever the enemy does to siphon your anointing, to diminish your anointing, to take away your anointing, he will fail over you in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The second word of prophecy, our Father in the Lord says, the Lord says there is someone here. I will send you two destiny helpers who will be more than sufficient for you. Amen. God will send to you two destiny helpers before the end of the month of March. In the name of Jesus, those helpers in Heron and Hall, as they lifted up the hands of Moses upon the mountain top for the victory that the children of Israel needed to be delivered to them. In the name of Jesus, your Heron and your all, your divine destiny helpers, your two helpers, they will locate you in the remaining days of this month in the name of Jesus. Say, Father, I am repositioned to locate my destiny helpers. I am repositioned for my destiny helpers to locate me. Right now, you are repositioned in the realms of the spirit. God will order your step. It will guide your feet. From today, you will connect with your destiny helpers. Those two destiny helpers that will be more than sufficient for you throughout this year, they will locate you. They will meet your needs. God will use them to support you, to lift your hands, to help you complete all those projects you've laid your hands upon. In the name of Jesus, God will send those two destiny helpers to you this month. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Thirdly, our Father and the Lord said, God said that we should laugh and laugh. He says, for every day of sorrow you've known, God will give you enough laughter. In the name of Jesus, just laugh in the Holy Ghost. Just laugh, laugh by faith. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Those days of sorrows and weeping that you've experienced before, God is saying, it is your time to laugh. It is your time to laugh. Sarah said in the book of Genesis chapter 21, verse 6, it said, God hath made me laugh, and they that see me. 
says, God has made me laugh so that all that hear will laugh with me. All those who will hear you from now, they will laugh with you. They will celebrate with you. They will rejoice with you because indeed God has made you to laugh. Whatever is called sorrow, whatever is called mourning, whatever is called sadness, whatever is called gnashing of teeth, whatever is called being weighed down, being depressed will be far from you. God has made you laugh. You will keep laughing and those who hear you, those who say you will laugh with you. In the name of the Lord Jesus, what will cause you to laugh throughout this year will happen to you. In the name of Jesus, your fruitfulness will manifest. Your miracles will manifest. Your promotion will manifest. Your healing will manifest. That which will happen for you will make your joy full and will cause people around you to rejoice with you and to laugh with you. God will make it to happen for you now in the name of Jesus. Please say, Lord, fill my mouth with laughter and fill my tongue with singing. The Lord will fill your mouth with laughter and your tongue with singing throughout this year. Sorrow will be far from you, from your home, from your family, from your loved ones in the name of the Lord Jesus. So shall it be in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. If you receive those words of prophecy coming to pass in your life, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. The Almighty God will perfect all he has started concerning your life in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you for joining us on the altar of victory today. Remember, you can share this video with friends and family and give a like to this video so that others can join to watch and pray them. Subscribe to this channel if you are yet to do so and be a part of this community. You can send your prayer request to us on altarofvictory247 at gmail.com. Let's pray together. I believe that your joy will be full and your testimonies will manifest. Have a wonderful day. God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen.